Well, October is recognized as Domestic Violence Awareness Month, and a local organization is stepping out to shed light on the harsh realities faced by so many survivors. Reporter Shakira Hawkins stopped by Safe Nest to learn more about their efforts. Safe Nest is reminding people that October is a crucial month for recognizing domestic violence survivors and letting their voices be heard. Last year, Safe Nest provided support to over 20,000 survivors, offering nearly 150,000 services. On Thursday, Safe Nest will host a press conference with Governor Lombardo and the Las Vegas Metro Police Department to address the alarming surge in domestic crime statistics and discuss current legislation to assist survivors. Later this month, Safe Nest is launching its fifth annual Run for Hope featuring a 5K and one mile fun run on October 22nd. So we serve a lot of the continuum of domestic violence. That includes what people normally think of, hotline, bed nights, crisis calls, but it also includes a lot of things people don't think of. So things like uh, empowerment services and long-term counseling and helping families sometimes reunite couples counseling, which is controversial in the space, but we know 75% of survivors are likely to return to their abuser. How do we make that home more safe and how do we help the abusive cycle stop? For more information on services and events provided by SafeNest, you can visit this web story at ktnv.com. Reporting from Las Vegas, I'm Shakira Hawkins.